The media's constantly sending gender-typed messages. Now, there's a variety of studies which show that the media does seem to have an impact on children's attitudes and values. So those children who watch more TV tend to have more stereotypical notions of gender and tend to conform more to norms of gender and gender typing. And an obvious assumption is that that's because the messages coming from TV are of gender norms and gender stereotypes. The same, incidentally, is true of engagement of in, in any sort of video game or, or computer game. But of course, it's not, you can't lay the blame wholly at the, the uh, foot of the media because it may well be that uh, although types of TV programme are preferred by boys and girls, it might be that, that of course, these TV executives are, are not fools. They've not got some evil agenda. They're simply targeting an audience. They know that little girls like princesses. They know that little boys like action. And they're simply pandering to those audiences. So it's a kind of vicious cycle, if you like, of gender stereotypes. This is the way the world is. This is these stereotypes, and we're going to just put them out there because no kid's going to want to watch a program about uh, this girl or no, a girl who's not engaging in gender stereotypical activities. Of course, some kids do, but generally speaking, what sells is stereotypes. Mm -hmm.